Hi traders, today um, we're going to take a look at uh, a feature walkthrough of the Forex Tester 3 uh, trading simulating platform. This is probably one of the uh, best tools out there and although it costs you um, around $199, um, it's actually worth your money especially if you are serious about uh, trading. Now, uh, one of the main features that was lacking in the previous versions of Forex Tester was uh, the ability to use Renko charts. But with the release of version 3, that has been, uh, that issue has been resolved and uh, now uh, Forex Tester 3 features inbuilt Renko charts. So in this video, we're going to take a look um, at a step-by-step -step process from uh, downloading the history to setting up your projects to generating the Renko charts adding the indicators and uh, placing a few simulated trades. So let's get started. Now the first thing that you see after you uh, install the Forex Tester platform is, is a generic screen. Um, in my case you, you see the Renko charts but this is just for illustration purposes. You can use a demo account for the Forex Tester and uh, this basically limits you to one month of uh, testing. So in order to unlock the uh, complete testing features, you need to click on help and register program where you can enter your username, email address and registration key. Once uh, the, uh, the uh, program is registered, the next step you need to do is to download the uh, history. You click on File, Data Center, and uh, this is the screen that you see. Now, I've actually imported a couple of uh, history for almost all of the instruments, but uh, let's do it again. Let's select EURUSD, GBPUSD, um, and uh, the Dollar Yen. You can select the broker from where you want to download the history, and uh, you can set your leverage. apply settings and uh, select update from server. Now you could select download part of history and uh, here I will select data from January 1st 2015 to August 31st. You can select the ignore weekend especially if you will set the uh, time frame to sorry, the time zone to GMT plus uh, 203. Select both download and tick history and click update. Now this is going to take a while depending on the uh, data history that you want to download and the number of instruments. In our case, we're looking at uh, Euro dollar, dollar yen and uh, pound dollar from uh, 2014 to August 31st of 2016. As you can see on the screen, the download is uh, quite fast compared to most of the platforms. So um, as long as you limit your currency pairs to a few and uh, within a reasonable range of uh, the download history, it should work pretty fine. Now we need to wait until the uh, download is complete of the uh, tick and the minute history. Okay, so the download has been completed. Now click exit. Now that we have the uh, history downloaded, the next step is to create a project. Click on project, select new project. And let's name it Renko Demo. And you can also select the deposit amount. Um, this would be the equity that uh, you want to use, so I'll select 1000. Remember that uh, you've selected the leverage at the time of downloading the history. So when you select 1000 here, uh, it basically means that you would be setting the leverage of 1 is to 200. So we select Euro USD, the same currency pairs for which we downloaded the history. Make sure to check generate ticks by OHLC points 
you've got your dates automatically selected here. You can also select uh, the uh, check the box use imported tick history especially if you want to test for Renko bars. In the next step you can select the time zone so I will select GMT plus 3 and uh, select the testing period whether you would like to test from the first uh, date in the range which is from 2014 or you want to preload a bit of history. In our case we will do a, a preload so I will have uh, the preload for about two months so we'll select from 3rd of March so that's about 61 days of preloaded data <coughs> So now the uh, data is being generated. And uh, here you have. As you can see right here, you have the Renko demo as the name of your project. You have your deposit of 1000. Now, the next step is to select File, Add New Renko Bar. Select Euro USD and uh, select the Renko bar size, which is uh, 5 pips. And here you have the Renko for uh, GBP USD. You can select the uh, chart settings to uh, for a uh, theme of your choice. There you have it. You can uh, do a bit of uh, customization as well. Zoom into the charts. So now that we have the Renko bars that are loaded, the next step is to add indicators. So in our case, let's take a look at uh, adding a moving average. Select the 50 period moving average. with uh, exponential as moving average type and apply to closing price click click apply and you have 50 period here we will select another moving average of 20 period and let's add uh, an oscillator Let's add stochastics, 14.33 and we've got our stochastics. Okay, so now that you have your Renko chart set up for the Forex tester, the next step is to run the simulator. To start testing, uh, what I would suggest is to reduce the slider for the testing speed. And as you can see, you have the simulated uh, price right there. So let's take a couple of trades. By the way, you can use the, uh, to place the orders, you can select a market order or a pending order. Press F2 or F3. So let's see. Uh, let's take a couple of uh, trades based on divergence. Okay, so I think price is going to fall right here. So I would take a sell order and set my uh, target to 1.373. So you've got the uh, simulation running. 
I will select modify order and set my target to 1.373 okay that's uh, the first trade which is moved into profit as you can see here now uh, I will simply slow down um, or rather pause and uh, take a couple of more trades okay so I don't see anything new here but uh, let's continue okay so I notice a bearish divergence right here so I'll target 1.373 once again Okay, that's another trade that's in a profit I guess by now <coughs> you guys would have understood that um, trading with divergence is one of my favorite ways to trade uh, the markets let's see if we've got uh, bullish divergence no nothing yet So as you can see the forex tester is uh, a really addictive tool um, you can have endless hours of fun practicing your trading strategies um, the the addition of the Renko bars on the chart makes it really interesting for interesting for um, for you guys to test out the strategies okay I think we've got uh, potential trade setup right here at 1.3775 that's just me opening another order can see that based on the leverage you have the uh, margin level right here the free margin your equity okay this divergence trade is taking quite a bit of time to, uh, to reach the uh, target level You can select the five minutes to speed up the data even more. Okay, so while the trades are running, let's explore a couple of other options. One of the most common questions that uh, one might have is, uh, can you run your own custom indicators? Unfortunately, you can't simply export the uh, MQ4 files into the Forex tester as it needs to be converted into a different, uh, um, different language. So uh, that is a bit of a drawback with the Forex tester 3 platform. However, having said that, um, I'm sure there are plenty of trading strategies that uh, make use of the existing indicators so uh, there really shouldn't be much of a problem with that you can also run a couple of automated trading strategies but uh, I will cover that in a later video 
um, so uh, yes, uh, this basically summarizes the uh, initial setup of the Forex Tester 3 platform with Renko charts. As you can see, it's quite a, a nice tool. You've got lots of uh, drawing options. You have, um, you can set up lots of annotations. And you, you, you can also add uh, multiple indicators to the charts. This is ideal to basically test out your um, manual trading strategies, but you could as well run automated trading setups um, on the Renko charts. So guys, I hope this video is helpful for you. Um, Forex Tester 3 is definitely worth um, worth its money, and uh, if you're really serious about uh, fine-tuning your trading strategy, then I would suggest you to definitely purchase Forex uh, Tester 3, which uh, is simply one of the amazing tools out there. So hope you enjoyed this video and um, if you have any questions, as always, um, use the comment box to uh, let me know. Have a good day.